Wow, there's the room. There's the. Oh, hello! Hi, how are you? That's crazy. The toilet opened when I when I walked by it. <laughs> <laughs> What's up guys, welcome to today's vlog. This is my friend Leonardo DiCaprio hanging out today. Hey. <laughs> I'm gonna be at the Irvine Improv this Sunday at two o'clock doing stand-up, so come down and see me. Uh, t get, the get, yeah. get your tickets, link in the description. Todd will be also boxing someone there. We have, if you wanna box Todd live on stage, uh, come do it. And also check out my merch, restwhenimdead.com. A uh, bunch of uh, hoodies and crewnecks and t-shirts and phone cases up there. We went to Vegas. Uh, on Sunday, last minute for Scott's birthday, we had a good time, and we got locked down at the airport. There was some serious stuff that went down there. What? And we all got pretty scared. I'm gonna watch this video. Hey, Jason. Yeah. You ever been to the year 3000? Yeah, I have a time machine. Okay. Wow. That was weird. I wonder what Todd meant by that, going to the year 3000. I guess only a few people know. Tyler Joseph followed me on Twitter last night, so <laughs> Oh, that, Todd was waiting to say that since we start since we started this video. Well, I'm on a Southwest Airlines flight. We just landed in Vegas. There was a coin flip that happened earlier today. I wasn't around for it, but apparently they flipped a coin. Now it's 10:30 on Sunday night. Hello. What's up? It's the Kilo. <laughs> Jerks are behind me. I'm gonna take you guys around Vegas tonight. And I think we're going to the palms. I'm gonna show you the palms. Show you. We gotta get flavor flavor. Being told to go grab flavor flavor. I guess I'm the flavor, I'm the celebrity uh Leah is on for David's vlog. I I did I did, I literally don't see him. I don't see him. You want me to run ahead? I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I don't know why I'm running. I'm 45, 22. I'm told to get Flavor Flav. If you guys know who Flavor Flav is, hip hop legend, public enemy. Flavor. 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 <laughs> Flavor, is that you? David now picking the lead. Flav what are we doing? This is so dumb. We've already started the vlog off with a bang, guys. Action packed. Okay, so there you go. There's something that was worth that was worth the trip. That's a good start to Vegas. You have to you have to say flavor flavor. Flav. Yeah. And then also being under a lockdown. <laughs> oh yeah. If I find out there is a terrorist on our plane, I'm gonna freak the. Yeah. <laughs> Why is there a lockdown? Why is there a lockdown in our it terminal right now? Anything. It's a lockdown in this area right now. Look, they're not letting anybody in right now. Whoa. Somebody in the terminal is like, uh oh. Shut up, shut up, shut up. this way. Wow. No, I know. Just want him to get away from over here. <laughs> 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 check it, check it, check it, check it, check it. Okay, Zane, so we're on the plane. We're on the plane, and he's going, I have in my ear. There's something awful yeah. in my yeah. ear. 
down on my nose. I go, it's, I go, it's the vape, like that. And he yeah. goes, should I go to the doctor? And I go, it's the vape. He goes, should I drink tea? <laughs> I'm going, it's, it's the, the vape. vape. But should Stop. my doctor, like, like clear it? <laughs> Stop smoking the drool. <laughs> Stop with it's the drool. It's not the drool, bro. <laughs> it is. I, I said it like ten times. He's like, it's all clogged up. Imagine. You, you, don't, you, you don't get, get it, bro. You don't get it. I get it. I know how hard it is to quit you're smoking. You're not on drool life. I'm on Nicorette. Exactly. <laughs> oh, if I had to quit my Nicorette, I would no, die. Exactly. If I said your entire body is falling apart. <laughs> it is. But yeah. <laughs> Go ahead. Stop the Nicorette. <laughs> I'd have to. I have to stop. I should stop. I'll stop the drool. You stop the Nicorette. I mean, I'll stop the Nicorette. Vice stop. versa? Yeah, other way. Mean it? Yeah, we should give me like another where's week. Your, where's your Nicorette? No, 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 no. Oh, so you're not that serious. But I'm not hurting from it. Me neither. <laughs> it's all clear, guys. I cleared it out. I took care of it. It was one woman that skipped through. <laughs> No, I mean, what's wrong with us? Why are we here? I don't know. But you know what? Now that I'm here, I'm happy I'm here. I, I walked into this casino and I was like, why the f <laughs> I went separately from everyone, so when I saw Snapchats and people on like a party bus on the way here, I was like, missing out on like all the good like, Nah, you didn't miss anything. Zane was twerking. It was like a five minute ride. So yeah, you missed everything. <laughs> I mean, that's Fantasy Tower. Ooh, anything can happen. So excited. What did you say, Scott? <laughs> we all came with nothing, and then look at Leanna's big. <laughs> <laughs> Leanna, how long are you staying? I wasn't at the Oh, right, right, right. <laughs> oh. called Optimus Prime. <laughs> David, what the f Good night, boys. I'm going to sleep. Oh, I'm sorry. Good night. That's very nice of you. No. It's about to go down in the toilet, David. It rattles up there. Oh, yeah. We should get a bed. That was like a snake. Yeah, I tried to die slow. Well, welcome to our vlog, everybody. Excuse me, welcome to my ah! Oh my god. Welcome to thank you, John. Welcome to the vlog. This is Jason. And John. We just ran three miles, and John, who's 20 years younger than me, was very, very nice and walked a lot of it. That's I, I, I've changed my mind about millennials. They're not all selfish. I was walking most of it to make fun of Jason for my Instagram story. <laughs> Guys, I, I don't know what to say. I don't know if any of this is usable because I'm so tired. We ran that in a half hour, right? It's three miles in how long? We 40? did three miles in like 35, 40 minutes. Yeah. Oh, that's we, not uh, really good at all. I thought it was in 30. Let's say it was 30. We can, uh, we can lie. Well, about 25. We're going to lie. We did three miles in 15 and a half minutes. <laughs> Well, we hit it hard, guys. We hit it hard today. I took two days off. I had my kids. By Friday, I did seven. So this is Monday. Tomorrow, go to the beach. Get my seven in. I gotta keep going, dog. <laughs> going to the beach. Gotta get my seven in. Next day, gotta get my ten in. Yeah. You know, just gotta keep raising, raising the bar. And then we raise the roof. After we raise the bar. First we raise the bar, then we raise the roof. Oh my god, this is the worst vlog. And then we raise a barn, because Jason and I are converting to uh, being Amish. We're gonna raise a barn. <laughs> That's a joke for you East Coasters out there. <laughs> Specifically those who live in Pennsylvania. Yeah. 
If you guys like quilts, look no further than the Amish. Yeah. What's it? Oh, yeah. And and look for John and I's new video, Rumspringa. What the hell, John? Guys, first I was Jason's assistant, then I was Jason's producer, and now I'm Jason's personal trainer. That's right. If you guys need personal training, hit me up at jasonnashbiz at gmail.com. Yeah. So, hey, John. I'll take a, take a small percentage. Yeah, Jason's my hand, he's my manager, my training manager. People will probably call you. I bet at least one person will be like, you can work me out, John. It's not gonna be a good workout. Literally all I'm gonna do is say, hey, come on, we should work out. I'm not gonna be like Jeff or Todd and be like, come on. Come on I'm not gonna push you, I'm gonna be like, hey. Yeah, that's what you do today. You're like, we can walk, we can walk. I was like, we can walk if you want. It's gonna be hard for you to get out of the car on that angle, man. The amicable trainer. Hey man, don't push it if you're not feeling it. No, I get it, I get it. Everybody gets tired. Here, yeah. I'll hold that, because that, that's hard to get out over there. You want, me get it? you want me to come over and hold it? Sorry. Watch how difficult, it's on an incline, it's so hard it's to get out. Hard to get out. See? <laughs> He's, ah, uh, you gonna hurt, you gonna slam your hand. I'm gonna be fine, Jason, I've done this before. <laughs> I love a good physical bit. You got a good... <laughs> No, no, you're gonna hurt your leg. I'm, I'm serious. Gonna be fine. I'm gonna be fine. I'm Why gonna be fine. I just ran three miles. It's strong. <laughs> yes. What a f commitment to that physical bit. <laughs> Here you go. Yep. <laughs> Take the rollerblades off! Ugh, Take the rollerblades off! Put these rollerblades on! <laughs> Do you want to describe your perfect day of eating? Yeah. Okay, like perfect, like, like I'm I'm happy and I'm staying in shape. Yeah. Or, oh no no no. Oh. Like you could eat whatever you want without any consequence. Okay. So I'm like gorging myself all day? Yes. Oh, you're gorging? Okay. Like disgusting okay, I'll just do last breakfast. day on earth. I'll do breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Okay. Breakfast. Um, like, like a blueberry pancakes. Like a gluten-free blueberry pancake. Why not leave the gluten in there? You're dying tomorrow. Yeah, okay. And bacon. That'd be my breakfast. What's your breakfast? And oh. coffee, obviously. Coffee. Oh, oh, oh. Coffee with maybe like, yeah, uh, like a latte, maybe a latte. Mm. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay, I would do um, a bacon, egg, and cheese. Ah, oh, uh, wow. On an everything bagel. Then I would do some kind of breakfast pastry, like a really hot, like a hot cinnamon bun, but a massive, like the Cinnabons. And with the, the drizzle. Yes. yes. Yeah, there's nothing better than a Cinnabon. That's good. Then you'd eat more than that. And then I would do like an ill. I think any more than that for breakfast is a bad move. I would do like a massive, <laughs> like a smoothie, yummy smoothie type drink with it. Really? What? And a latte. With milk? A milk? In the smoothie? No, no, no. no. Oh, yeah, yeah. But like, just something like really yummy, fruity, like high in sugar. Wow. Okay. Yeah. That, was, that was good. Okay, mm -hmm. you ready? Lunch? Ready. Let me think for a minute. All right, well, that's what I have to do. I would go to the, a Chinese uh, restaurant, this place called Joss, have Chinese food. Yeah. Uh, I'd have like sesame chicken, shuma, shrimp shumai, wonton soup, Yeah. and like a shrimp fried rice. <sighs> that would be my lunch. Great. Great, go. Okay, I would do a fusion. And by that I mean Chinese food as well, but on the side, Pizza pie. <laughs> so I would go no. to like a real deal, like Din Tai Fung soup Din dumplings. Din Tai Fung. So I do Su Long Bao, which is soup dumplings. Yeah. With, um, they have these rice cakes, which are like these glutinous, like rice, like they're like little rice slivers. It's yeah. very interesting, but delicious. I would do these chicken rice cakes and then like shrimp Shanghai fried noodles. 
Then I would, oh wow! Uh, oh please! Then I would do like this little cucumber salad that they have. Then I would do a pan fried dumpling. So I would do the steamed soup dumplings, but also a pan fried. <laughs> I don't. I, I know that Din Tai Fung. It's just dumplings. I like like sesame chicken. I like like they have beef and pea pods. They don't have. They don't have egg rolls. They don't have. No, no. It's I, just I don't want Chinese food. I don't like Din Tai Fung. I'd also want orange chicken. So I'd have to get that shipped in from somewhere good. They don't have it. Well, this is my last day, so I figure it out. So you're bringing orange chicken to Din Tai Fung. I'm bringing a pizza. I might as well bring... And then I would bring Prince Street pepperoni pizza. I've had Prince Street. And, and that would just be lunch. Why, why not just... Now, see, what I, what I did, and where I think you went wrong, is I did Chinese for lunch. That's it. Because I, too, love pizza. But... Dinner. Italian. And then you could just do it all. That's fine. You're right. And I'm just <laughs> I'll move the pizza back. You're yeah, right. Great point. Prince Street Pizza. Wait, and then would you do a, a lunch dessert or would you save all your dessert for dinner? No, no, I wouldn't be able to I wouldn't be able to do dessert. I mean I know I'm overweight, but I would, there's just a point. I would buy just an entire Carvel ice cream cake. Yeah. If I do the oil. Yeah, man, I would just get a whole Carvel or a Baskin Robbins ice cream, cream cake. What's not to love? And you don't get ice cream cake a lot. No one's pulling out ice cream cake that often. Especially West Coast. No. Do you know who makes a great one? Fresh homemade? Who? My wife. Dinner, go. Dinner, okay. Uh, penne vodka with rigatoni. Oh. Chicken parm. Prince Street pizza. Oh. And fry calamari. An antipast. Ooh. Caesar salad. And then to finish it off, some sort of apple crisp strudel a la mode with vanilla ice cream. I'm, I'm going to do exactly what you did for dinner. I'll have what he's having. I'm going to have carrot cake for, for dinner. For, for, uh, for dessert. I'm going to have a bite of that carrot cake. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh, you would. Yeah, I would. And you'd be welcome. Thank you. Your fork would be welcome on my side. Yeah, and I would get a majority of it would be the cream cheese frosting. <laughs> Just, and just a hit of cake. All frosting for me too. Yeah. And just a little bit. Yeah, people who don't eat frosting, what are you trying to prove? Uh -huh.